After finishing last season 26 and 2 before falling in the section finals to Roseau, Brainerd Little Falls girls hockey is back and ready to take the next step. Clayton Castle has more. The Brainerd Little Falls Flying Warriors are flying high this season. Off to a hot 5-0 start to begin the 2017-18 campaign. Anytime you're starting the season, you want to start well. Um, you know, kind of shows a little bit of that what you've done is, you know, helped you put your team in a good position to win. The team finished 26-2 and last season before falling in the section finals to Roseau. The girls say that preparation in the offseason is key to making a run this year. We just worked really hard over the summer and have been pre preparing a lot so that that doesn't happen again. Despite having to replace last season's leading scorer, Ali Smith, the Flying Warriors feel that depth is a central strength of this team. We've got three lines we're really comfortable with. We've got three sets of D that we're really comfortable with. And, you know, last night I think we had four different girls score goals. You know, we've seen that, you know, through our first five games where we've had, you know, the score sheet with two, three, four different girls contributing, and that's what it's got to be. On the ice, though, the speed of which the team flies up and down the ice is a force to be reckoned with. We definitely have a lot of speed, and that helps us to, um, for back checking, we can get back and help our defense out. We're fast, and we have a good defensive core, and it's always nice that our forwards always come back. We're a back checking team, and we're grinders. We always work down low. The Flying Warriors return a number of players from last season, providing veteran leadership for a team poised to find its way to the state tournament. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.